is going on? We are back. Another one. It's been a while. I know. I'm sorry. But it was a lot of moving parts in January. I had, I went down to Florida. I, you know, I needed some relaxation and now we're back. As you can see, it's a different setup. We're back at Hofstra. Uh, will I get the fourth and final, the concluding one out by the time we go back to class? Probably not. I'm sorry, but at least you'll get the third one out when we do, do go to class and you guys get, uh, get excited about that. So we are back with another Italy vlog. Uh, most of it's edited. Just got to add this in. Um, this one we are in. We go to Vesuvius. We go to Naples. We go to Florence, Venice. This is a jam-packed vlog with a lot of stuff going on, a lot of moving parts. One of the more interesting parts of the trip because it was just constantly something going on each and every single day. So that was a really fun time and uh, a lot of us got to enjoy it together. Now, there's nothing else really much to say except let's just enjoy going to it and uh, I'll see you guys in there. Something cool I didn't know about Napoli or Naples is that we have a living creamsicle. Oh, bro. Come on. And it's it's honestly it, it reminds me of a lot of people from New Jersey because it's it's got a lot of attitude and a lot of sass. And um yeah. Go mama, go, go, go. Alright, so it's cream school meets Lilo and Stitch meets SpongeBob. Oh my god. I'm completely sober. <laughs> Brady, it's you! <laughs> Every time when I look into your eyes, I start to make up a song that goes like this. Cha 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 So, welcome to my crib. Oh my god. Hi vlog, um, MTV, welcome to my crib. This is my hallway, one of 900. Um, we have all these doors, no idea where they go to. Nice ceiling. I don't know what it's called. The floors, the floor. These are my grand staircase. I can um, confirm Cass lives here. Uh, one time I stopped by. You get off, you get off second stop on the B line in Manhattan. It takes you right here. And, nice. Uh, that's Cass's house. <laughs> the stop is actually called uh, Faber Residence <laughs> on the subway. All right, big day today. Big day. You can't tell. I mean, I don't think you can tell right now. We are on Vesuvius. We're going to the top. And it's going to be wild. Tino is definitely ready to go. Beep boop beep up. Hello, Vesuvius. Team Patino here. I'm on my way. Good morning. I didn't know it was. Rise and shine. It's 11 a.m. Time to hike. Vesuvski time. Vesuvski. Um, are those? These are my Terratolini. Terratolini. Yeah. Pomodoro a Basilisco. Okay. And I'm going to rate them a 3 out of 10. They're pretty bland. One of the sides, a weak spot. Oh. <laughs> Wherever the weak spot is, don't be near it when it happens. Or you die. Hi, Cass. Hi. 
Hi, Maddie. Hi. Where are we? We're at the top of Mount Vesuvius, except we still have some more to go. But um, this is just quite possibly the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Now, question, question. Yes. How did how did we get here? Teleportation. Yeah. Um, I blinked a few times and I said um some words. Like I clicked my heels three times. I said, "There's no place like Mount Vesuvius. There's no place like Mount Vesuvius. There's no place like..." And then we came. Here. And now we're here. It was amazing. We got a buggy. On. It's okay. I'm okay. They're not biting me. But look at this view, guys. Isn't it spectacular? At the tippity. Hey, we did it! I'm so excited. I had so much fun. Hi. Oh God. What's up? Hey, gang. Look at Steve, what a majestic man. Just over here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's me. This These are like gladiators. So now you're probably wondering, Tom, why are you panning the camera at these old buildings? Well, I'll tell you. This city is Ercolano, and it doesn't get as much recognition as its counterpart to the southwest, Pompeii. It's another city that was covered in magma from the Mount Vesuvius eruption in 79 AD. It was actually the first archaeological dig in the world. As you can see, most buildings are still intact and even the tile, some paintings, and even wood are in still great condition 2,000 years later. All right, gang, what big day. Up, gang? My name is Cassandra Faber. I'm welcome back to Two Great Fifty Five's channel. We're about to get hit by a car. Um, big day today. Big day. Big day today. All right. I'm singing. Okay. <laughs> We're going first to the Pantheon, then to the Colosseum, then to the Forum where Julius Caesar was. <laughs> but wait, that's where he died. Wait, that's where he died. Yes. Thank God. That's the place we've been passing. With the cats? No, that's not the forum. Yeah, it is. That is? Yeah. There's no way. Guys, look, it's my secret service. Yes, sir. Mr. President, get down. <laughs> Pantheon done. That was quick. Kind of very fast. Very fast. It has a hole. Um, now we're moving to the Coliseum, and that should be good. Only one hole, just like I have. Yeah, Tino only has one hole, guys, and it's his mouth. Are right, my fullest apologies, ladies and gentlemen. We did not see the Coliseum yet. We saw where Julius Caesar wished. Thank God. All right. That's all I wanted to say. All right. That's all right. All Relax. Anyway, now we're going, I think, to the Coliseum. I think right now is, so we'll say. <laughs> all right, we're at the Coliseum. Coliseum, baby. We just learned that us gingers, we would be basically sheep to these people. And uh, they'd let us. If they wanted red hair. If they wanted red hair for wigs. And uh, they just make us go bald. And then. Let us regrow our hair and then make us go bald all over again and turn us into wigs. So, will you wear wigs? Will you wear wigs? When will you wear wigs? Have you, have you worn wigs? Whoa, whoa! <laughs> whoa, hey, hey, whoa, whoa. whoa! Watch yourself over there, Miss Italian. It. Watch yourself. Whoa! Oh. Uh oh. oh. Thank God we're tall. Thank God we're tall because she can't reach. You got me there. Are you not entertained? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. Jamie told we have to us. Go yeah, I know Jamie. Yeah. Yeah. I've been waiting for this. I am. I've been waiting for a Roman Colosseum toilet to take a dumper in. The gang's in Florence. What's up, gang? Yo. Gang. 
Florence. Guess hey, what tomorrow hey, is? Okay. Tomorrow's my birthday. If anyone didn't know, my birthday is June 17, 2001. I was born at 12.53 or 56 p.m. It was a Sunday, it was Father's Day. It makes a lot of sense with me. If you know, you know. <laughs> you didn't hear my joke. I did hear your joke. It was funny. <laughs> I'm not gonna say why, but if you know, you know. I'm not gonna make this vlog depressing. Um, we're currently on a tour of Florence. Um, it's a fun time. Tom's being mean to me. I haven't said a word. That was the answer I was for yes. All right, gang. It's maze time. Let's All right, gang, this. it's Tom's gonna go buy me something from Gucci. Uh, oh. All right, Mace time. Guys, I feel like I'm in the show. What? Think this maze is haunted? Yes, 100%. Oh, we're out. We made it, guys. Easy, 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 easy. We are. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes, we're right there. Piazza della Repubblica. Yeah. Where's your All right, I'm about to show you guys some of the coolest, this is like one of the most beautiful buildings I've ever seen in my entire life. Look at this. Are you kidding me? Are you crying? Only a little bit. Oh my God. Why is it cooler than the one at St. Peter's? Oh, because it's girthier, it's wider. It's the it's the it's the widest dome, like the biggest dome. Where people in like Rome will say that St. Peter's Basilica has the biggest dome, but really no, it's just the tallest. This one has girth. This is one of my favorite cities that we've been to this whole trip. This is honestly, it is gorgeous here. But like for real though, it's gorgeous. <laughs> I, I feel at home. This is unbelievable. I feel like I belong. We just saw that where the Jersey Shore cast stayed. My life is complete. My um, Italy private story complete. I don't know what to do now. Yeah, she named her her uh, Italy private story Jersey Shore Italian vacation. So it just that really just tied it all together. So we'll, we're gonna keep you updated. I think we're going to overlook out like whatever the hell it is tonight. So by Michelangelo. So yeah, we have that type of clout. I am still technically 20 years old for another two hours, but it's okay. If you didn't know, today's my birthday. Great day, fantastic day, fun day. So my hair was braided by Elena. I'm taking it out when I take pictures. Sunglasses are in fact Target. Um, water is Market. Phone, Apple, phone case, Amazon. Dress, let's just take a moment for the dress, okay? So like party in the front, business in the back type of thing, you know? It's one of those. Um, this dress is from a little boutique. I don't know the name of it because it was in a mall. But it's cute. It was like probably like it was pretty pricey. Not gonna front. The shoes are um, TJ Maxx. And then my bag is in fact YSL. It was two thousand dollars. I bought it for myself. It, I think it was. Is that already in the vlog? Well, it is now. This is my bag. I can do a bag haul, but T Grady Fifty Five would kill me. So I would to edit that out. So I'm not gonna do that. Um, I'm here with all my friends. Being all my besties. Um, we're going to see David, right? I think so. Who's David? All right, obviously we know today's Cass's birthday. Um, it's a national holiday. But we are not here for Cass's birthday. We are, we're here for Cassandra. We're Marie's going to birthday. see The David by Michael Andrews, so that's gonna be fun.
because my instrument aren't there. So it is bigger than me. So it's a little bit of a struggle, but it works. That's on, I didn't know you even played. Pretty cool. What can you I say? You seem like a clarinet type person. I did play clarinet for like seven years. That's crazy. <laughs> How did you know that? That was just a pure guess. Wow. I was gonna say flute, but I was like, nah, clarinet. No, She's like Squidward. <laughs> what was that? I'm not gonna do that one. Hi, David. David DeWallis? No. Is that, he, is that David DeWallis? I didn't know DeWallis was here. I never wanted to see David naked. But... <laughs> <laughs> you got a point. You got a point. I'm not sure if I wanted to see that, but you know, here we are. Here we are. Imagine rowing and then you Shrek ass. <laughs> They're like, oh, oh. <laughs> Pull. Pull. oh my god, look at that plane. There's so many modes of vehicles out here. <laughs> Train. Boat. Bus. Uh, Bus. Oh. Bus. Bus. <laughs> Can I get Wait, a bus? Hold on. The bus is on a train on a boat. With a plane. Insight. We're going to Venice. You see me like go the whole time. Oh, I did, yeah. Steve, you look like you command the high seas. I do. Look at these guys. So as you can see, it was a lot of fun this whole trip. The this this whole week was just like I said, jam packed full of stuff. I felt bad because my mic started to like kind of like flutter in and out. You know, like I'll start recording and the mic won't be on, or it just like when it was connected, it wasn't working right. So a lot of the clips I had to actually cut because it was just unusable because I don't know what anyone is saying. Everyone looks great in them, but we have no idea what they're saying. Um, it was a lot of fun. Venice was a, a wonderful experience. It was awesome to be there. It was, I, I, you know, it's it's cool to go to a place that, you know, eventually down the line, especially with the way the earth is right now with global warming and all that, it might be underwater. So to be in a place like that was really awesome. Uh, being on top of Vesuvius, I felt like I was on top of the world. Uh, up there you you were breathing some really fresh air it was crazy how we got up there it was just like i can still think about like how we just hopped over a rope to get up there 
And that was what I was trying to get out of Maddie, but she said teleportation. So we'll take that. And then, of course, Florence. I mean, the Duomo is just one of the most beautiful buildings I've ever seen in my entire life. It probably is just based because it, there's not a single ounce of paint on it. It's all just marble from Africa and all these other places around the world. And that's the color of the stone. It just looks amazing. So I don't know when the fourth episode will come out. Hopefully it's, it's soon. I know I'm going to get like, I, this is on my brain. I want this to be out. I want everyone to enjoy this. And for the support that I've been get, uh, been getting from everyone, it's been awesome. It's been wonderful to hear. And I'm so excited to see the reactions to this episode. Um, other than that, I'll see you guys soon. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all that YouTuber stuff. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Peace.